Hi guys and ladies, I found a recipe online titled, The Very Best Fish Recipe Ever. <laughs> I don't like people who lie and brag. So my idea is to put this recipe to the test. And I went to the supermarket, I picked up all the ingredients. Ah, 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 except one, and you know what it is, the fish. I'm gonna make my first cast right here, off the dock. Oh no. Let's see if we could catch some bass today. We can at least start with this. It's a 1 15th ounce finesse shrooms jig head, and on it is a four inch Archie twin trailer. Well, you can read all about everything, the tackle, the lake, the recipes, and more in the notes below. But right now, let's get out there and fish. I wasn't having any success with that Arky twin tail, so here's called a Yum's Lizard. Let's give this a try. It's almost the same. I don't think it's the lure. It's the bad conditions. Yeah. Wow! It's so puny! Look. I know in other lakes you're supposed to return these little ones, but not in Lake Catch a Big One. It's the opposite. These are the ones we have to call and remove from the lake, according to the biologist, so I'll keep the little guy. Yeah. I thought so. <laughs> Another little guy, but it's food. Ha <laughs> ha, that's a fish. Unfortunately, that's too big to eat. 15 inches, nice fish. The problem is I have to release the big fish in this lake, opposite of other lakes. Oh, I was little. <sighs> They're either too big or too little today. Yep. <laughs> ah! Another toddler. What is it? That's the one. That's the one. Perfect eating size. Though it's 13 inches. I should return it. It's a little over the rule. But I make the rules, so I'm keeping them. Yes. Hang on. Another baby. Yep. Little. <laughs> Got to remove these. Look. Look. <laughs> Another little guy. I have plenty for food. I was hoping to catch a bigger one though. Lucky here, I've got eight little bass. I needed to cull them from the lake anyway. There's just too many mouths to feed and they'll never grow big. So this should give us close to a pound and a half of fish fillets. 
for the very best fish recipe ever? We'll see about that. Let's get back in the house and fillet them. Yesterday we caught mostly dinky bass, but those are the ones we need to remove from the lake anyway. And check this out. Look, we have over a pound and a half of these great fish fillets. So let's start right in on this recipe with its highfalutin claims of best fish recipe ever. We'll see about that. I'm trying to chop up these green onions. I have no knife skills at all. Oh, they roll everywhere. No. Let's see how much juice I can get from this big lemon. Okay, so I have this bowl here, and I've got this belgioioso parmesan. I don't know how to say it. Belgioioso. And look, it's shredded parmesan. I'm going to put a, a cup of that, a healthy cup. Here's a stick of softened butter. I'm going to add that. Belgioioso. I like to say that. Now I'm adding like six tablespoons of mayo. Now we're supposed to add our lemon juice. Four tablespoons. I didn't measure. Ah, the chopped green onions. So looky here, I have this lightly dried parsley. This stuff is really good. I tasted it. It's so much better than dried. And here it is, a tablespoon. We got to kick this up. Let's put a few dashes of this Tabasco. Here's about one third teaspoon each of salt and pepper. We've got to stir this now very well. It smells great. Belgioioso. This stuff looks good. I could eat it right from the bowl. I've got this baking sheet and I lined it with non-stick foil, but watch. I'm going to spray it with butter spray. I've got our broiler going here and I've laid the bass out on our baking sheet. And all I'm going to do now is pop them under the broiler for six or seven minutes naked. No seasoning, just naked like this. Here goes. While our fish is roasting away in the oven, I have to tell you the famous celebrity restaurant and food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks has accepted my invitation for dinner tonight. You know, we've been seeing each other for over 50 years, but she has yet to give me any signals that she really wants to marry me. If only she would just like give me a hint that she's thinking about marriage. I'd be so happy. Oh well, let's see how it turned out. Nothing special, but hang on. All I'm doing now, as you see, is spooning on our mixture of uh, Belgioioso Parmigiana. And look how good it is. It smells great. All right, they're all covered with our Belgioioso uh, creamy sauce. And now it's going back under the broiler for two minutes. It's been two minutes, let's see what we have. Whoa! Wow, they smell fantastic. They look great. I don't know about the best fish recipe ever, but it's gonna be close. I'm gonna put these aside now and show you a little side dish real quick. Look what I got here. This is called savory herb rice cauliflower and it's from bird's eye and all you have to do is put this in the microwave for four and a half minutes you don't even have to punch a hole in the bag so here goes oh it smells really good oh yeah i think i'll do another package of this Well, here we are once again with the famous celebrity restaurant and food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks. And thank you for dining with me tonight. You, you joined me at my uh, shabby mobile shack. And um, you had a chance to partake of my savory herbed rice. And what did you think of that rice? Now, that was very good, that fake rice. And uh, it was nice to know it exists. Yeah. And I will definitely be going to the store to buy some of my own. Four and thank a half you. minutes in oh, the microwave. It was I can't very beat tasty. That. Yeah, thank yes. you. And what about the uh, fish with the cheese oh. sauce and Belagio Oso? Yes, well, my compliments to you, the chef. Oh, thank it you. It was very tasty, and I love the rich butter and the uh, cheesy it flavor. It was cheesy, yes. yes. Thank you so very much. Very good. 
Thank you. Uh, Miss Cheeks. Yes. Oh, uh, I may use your first yes. name now. Uh, you know, Lulu, uh, we've been kind of seeing each other for over 50 years now, and I've been wondering when you'll introduce me to your mother. Uh, the weather has been beautiful lately. Huh? Mm. Can I have a hug?